Well, I mean, I could start this video by giving you a whole speech about we're back at Hoppo's and this and that, but I feel like at this point in this series, you already know that. If you watched a few of the videos, you're like, yes, Georgia, we get it. You're, you're at Hoppo's working on your truck. So I feel like that goes without any introduction that we are here and we are back and we are working on the truck because why else would you be watching these videos? You came here to see a mini truck be built, so that's what we're doing. That being said, with the things that we're doing, things just keep changing. And by changing, I mean things don't fit and they're having to get cut. Let's do this. So with cutting it, it's dropping. It's getting lower. And so if you can see up here, it's been cut out, cut out a bit. And then now the engine back here. So this is gonna have to get cut. It's lower than what body dropping yes. would even be. I mean, we're not without even cutting the pinch wall. But the pinch, like, because you think about it, it's gonna sit on the frame. So like, right now the pinch is below. The pinch is way this 
we're going to need extra fresh cuts. Just like that, back on the palate, it goes.
run cylinders in the back of the truck. So there's various options for places that they could go. We don't want to mount them in just any old normal spot, but I'm just letting the man do what he does best. I told him, do what your heart desires because I don't know as well as he does. So. I watched a few YouTube videos, that's it. He watched a few YouTube videos, he's gonna try and figure it out. So. Your's too, his too. None 
of us will be happy with it. All right, things are coming together. I feel tired though, I'm not gonna lie to you. And you know what, if I'm tired now, imagine how bad it's gonna be like a month from now when we're still doing this. The results will come. The results will come.